Hi guys, welcome. Danny here from the Magic Junk Drawer. And if today is your birthday, January 6th, then you are an Eight of Spades person. Here is your angel card reading. These cards are very hard to shuffle because they're so big. But I'll pick three. First one is your past. The King of Earth. Generous, professional, practical, responsible. Successful time. Confidently accept opportunities that you're offered and the Midas touch. Here is your present. Unity, Archangel Sandalphon. Traditional viewpoints and methods, spiritual organizations, seek out mentors and like-minded friends. Your future. The night of fire, passionate, adventurous, self-assured, restless. The sudden, a sudden event that needs immediate intention. Time is of the essence. Think things through carefully. Okay, so what do we have here? We've got a successful time, the Midas touch. That's your recent past. And then you've got some traditional viewpoints and methods, which is so common for a Capricorn to be traditional. Spiritual organizations seek out mentors and like-minded friends, but something is going to need your attention quickly. So it could be some, it doesn't always have to be such a crisis. Like whenever I see something like that for myself or if somebody were to say it to me, I'm like, oh my God, what's happening? Take a breath. It doesn't have to be that big of a deal. Okay. And here is your playing card. The three of clubs. Clubs, I always think of clubs as chit-chat, talk. So with three people, it could be talking to two other people. You could be something sudden maybe comes up and you're discussing it with some of your friends. Um, there could be a little bit of indecision or maybe you're not sure what to do and you're discussing it with your friends because maybe you need some advice. But I don't think that it's a bad thing. I don't think that, you know, sometimes you need advice like, uh, you know, you just have like a question about, I don't know, it could be anything from like decorating your house. Maybe you're discussing it with your friends, like uh, should I hire this guy or should I hire that guy? It doesn't have to be that big of a deal, but it could be something that does immediately need attention. And if you like what we're doing here at the Magic Junk Drawer, don't forget to subscribe and we will see you soon. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.